Hello and welcome to SG Speechless. Today I'm going to be continuing with my Getting a Victory Out with all my skin series. Today's will be cool. Let's go, go, go. So I need to complete a sideways encounter, which is one there. Which they are actually quite hard, so I'm going to try to map up as much as I can. Maybe land Orchard and push my way over there, most likely. And so with the legendary challenge for Taurin. And there's also complete waves, complete waves, a few monsters in the sideways, which is similar. Same thing going that rift thing over there, the purple rift, which is called the sideways anomaly. And then you get Dark Jonesy's quest line down. I still haven't figured out whether or not if I can find a phone box, I'm going to see if, uh, a telephone, I'm going to see if I can then potentially claim a quest for... Um, for, um, who was it? There's somebody I've already done the quest for. I don't know if you can do the quest again and they count for your. If you just, like, can get them for your dailies or it doesn't like, count at all. Maybe, I don't know. I had a look the other day and I had a quest for Penny I could do, but I already completed her, so maybe you can. Probably gonna pick up these orange paint cans or tuna fish. Why not? Might as well. Get as many as I can, or when I see them anyway. Yeah, I do like this the um, this skin to be fair, it's pretty sweet looking. Especially the red style. Okay, it's pretty nice. I'm gonna keep the big shield, be smart, see if I can find any minis. Yeah, there didn't seem to be anyone who landed on me, so that's good. The newest set that came out was a Valenciaga set, which oh, alright, some of these outfits are alright, but they have two different bundles, two skins in one for 1,800, two skins in another. 1,800, pretty sure, then 1,200 or 1,400 for the weapon wraps, the pickaxe, and the emo. I'll take two ARs, just solely. So you'll need to spam quite a lot on the um, sideways. It's alright if you don't bump the explosive guys. If you bump the explosive guys, then you're kind of a bit, a bit out of luck. See, so yeah, I move that out there for this the nice mini. Patience did pay off. I really do enjoy playing solo squads. I've been playing it for a while, to be fair. I was playing it last season when I was actually doing Battle Royale. It just you know, puts a little bit more of a, um, a pressure on him. So don't, solos are not really the... I'm alright at solos, it's just very sweaty. And most of the time when I play solos, I get like third party. It just sucks, you know, getting late game, getting third party. A lot of people just don't really take fights in solos or um, trios or duos or anything other than solos yeah, they will actually take fights especially when they see a solo so it can be kind of be very interesting at times to take a fight against the squad and beat them there are times you can like stuff you can't do that when they have like recon scanners and all that they have a decent team you just can't do anything but it's always good just to see if you can challenge yourself a bit nice more minis I don't have an SMG yet, I'm not an SMG, I don't have a shotgun yet. Oh, I'll take the harpoon then. Yeah, I'll get rid of that. Get that out, get that there, get that, cool, nice. Let's have a look and see if they've something's running out of thingy. They have as well. People go there so quickly though. You just gotta land there and get it done. Oh well. I head over there and I'm basically anyway get the um Get the phone and see if I can have an Everquest or something. Oh, green for the auto. Yes, please. My quest defeat Q Monster. Finish a downed enemy with a harvesting tool. Complete a sideways encounter and make donations to Wyfit's donation box. Not too hard, not too hard. I was going to land at Brock first, who just... Ooh, there's a survivor right next to one of them. And down the sideline, there were no one Someone just killed a animal over there. Sideways and on the other one, sideline, they're sideways. Yeah. Somebody defo killed an animal at... Craggy or near Craggy, anyway. 
I can get max wood out of the game. I do take a fight against multiple people, which I most likely will. I do need to remember to pickaxe so I have a chance to pickaxe on the enemies I down to get the legendary challenge down to dust. All our challenges are like damage based challenges. I damage enemies within 30 seconds of landing, deal damage with a pistol or SMG, and keep them elimination with a pistol or SMG. And then I can't remember what stage 4 is, no. Stage 3. I don't know. I know the last one's to, um, obviously, uh, pick out a downed enemy. Okay, I don't want that. I'm on, what am I for half some work? Come on. I don't think they just like maybe disappear if nobody um, goes for the anomalies. I have no idea. Rifting on anomalies. <laughs> Can't speak. But yeah, I'm not sure. They, it is quite hard. Like, there's usually three waves, and to complete the encounter, you have to do three waves. Obviously, it probably isn't helping that I'm doing solo squads, so it probably would be better to actually do. Oh, there's two. Oh my lord, look at that lark. Two lark. Oh, hello. Two llamas right next to each other. Okay. I was leaving you alone. Look how much health llamas actually have. I ain't gonna be able to kill both of them though. I don't have a high enough damage output. Cheers, mate. Correct the hell out of my head. There's a burst as well. Let that fix your drop too. Yeah. Face explode, I'm tempted. Down down them boys. I ain't having an AR fight with a kid like this. Yeah, I ain't having an AR fire, I'm just coming to charge him. I know it's a little bit of maybe a waste of a jump pad, but oh well. He has a burst, he's going to do way more damage if he can headshot me with that. I need, but I still count as a pickaxe still. Hopefully. <laughs> I don't know if it will actually. I don't know if he still won the big shield or just had a big shield on him, I'm not 100% sure. Might as well just cut, stack a med kit, see how much, um, how many, I think it's two big shields down there maybe? That's obviously the problem when you're spamming. Oh, there's something all the way over there. I marked that, maybe jump pad over there, why not? Get a little bit of action. So apparently that didn't count, so. Oh, good. Ah, uh, drop down, carry big shields. So as a boy, I wonder if that's a car then. It's like four big shields, but that would probably make sense. Really not again, mate. That boy had it out for me. <laughs> Jumping to hit the tree again, anyway. Go to the tree, that go to the right, so there's one player there. That kid had teams as well, so. There's a lot of loot over there. But he's just put my building menu on so I can get a lot of speed. It's very hard for these guys to do. It's a running down below. I'll run back up. A6 blue. It's probably the guy's team actually. Get it. The number one. Go for a little bit of risky play. Box this guy in. Attack him, hopefully. Take out, attack him. Actually, no, I got a hit in that 
fight. Oh, there's llama, there's llama still over there, though. Well, I didn't just absolutely choke a point blank shotgun shot at all. The pro strat build. I see a guy's marker. I do it. Now, I'm pretty sure there's never. I can get a bit to grab that. Maybe I'll maybe grab that ever big shield that was over there near the jump pad. I had it to pretty awful at the moment. Pretty done that quest, so nice. One of my dailies done. Yeah, I was going to go to the telephone, wasn't I? Yeah. Seem to always get distracted. Big shields there. Go on, grab that. This hill is still quite a good land spot actually. If you land up there like where I used to land, you can usually go all to the right, there's a CD little IO encampment over there. And you can get quite a lot of good loot. And if you want to run an easy shield, just come down here and then it used to be a slurp truck, but they changed that quite a while back actually. This spot was a little bit too good. So I might just run down to grab it and then just hit the jump pad. It is very good, you know, since they bring back the jump pad, you can get very aggressive on players. Like if I was having an AR fight, it probably would have took like, maybe a few minutes to kill that player. Um, pretty sure I've already done this guy there. That'll give me see whether or not I can actually um, get any XP for doing them. Yeah, I was going to hit the jump pad. I ain't going to take me very fast, it's probably better for me just to run, but... Decent mats, 999 wood, 906 brick, 130 metal. Metal I'd like more, but if I get into a lot of fights, I'll probably get quite a lot of it. Where have I got to go to anyway? Okay. There's no, there's no anonymous... No anomalies there, <laughs> so I can't do any of those. Which is kind of a bit of a rip. So just got a, a hot land them. Um. Just jump down it. So he killed that. He's going to try to reboot. That's what he's going to do. I'm going to take an AR out of this kid, slightly white, and that kid has no shields. He's still sat there, though. Come on, dude. Made that car extremely weak. <laughs> He has no shields, so that's when he ran off. You get me thinking, oh crud, you know he's got shields. Let me switch to a different map. Down the tree. Now he has a P90, sweet. Shockwave launcher. Yeah. 
this kid have any idea? I know there's one there, one just went in that building. Get that guy. There's three or four of these guys, I'm not sure. Can't get in that room, so take him out. I'm in here, I think. I'm just out, but I'm popping med kit. Give it 20 health, could come clutch. And I'm at. Absolutely bowling for Max though, so. Even Matt, I'm doing well. I'm gonna try to use my wood as much as I can and then prioritize using. I'm just see what next server goes actually, I'm not gonna peek anything. Thank you, peeks, I'm headshot on that guy, I'm gonna peek it. Just jumping in, that's fine. Crack out. Good old free layer tower strap. He's probably going to shoot me down. Won't be any higher than this. You don't want to fight me. You want to fight that free man, dude. That's what you want to do. Could have a jump pad down. I just want to, I'm going to try not to shoot this solo. I just got a goddamn car. Is he a psycho? He's still in it. One, it seems. I've cracked to high heaven. Out kill, pop some shields. Bit dubsky if I can. Yeah, I need to push towards him. Bring out my brick, push towards him. An absolute psychopath, all my metal. I might be able to pre dog at the moment. I'm in circle, so I'm just gonna play smart. I'll knock him down. That'll knock him out, I'll knock him out. Okay. Let's go. So that kid prioritised trying to knock my builds down, which was not the smartest move. But yeah, let's go. So that's a cheeky little eight kill win with the what the hell is the skin called? The core skin. Let's go. It was pretty clutch and pretty close in some of the parts of that game. When I got pushed by that bounty team, or he literally pushed me and then grabbed the bounty below me. But yeah, so that is a victory out of the core skin. Let's go.